Alright, welcome to part 24 of Hardcore Breath of the Wild. There's a thing in the distance that means we could probably get some rupees and whatnot, but whatever. Um, it's not really that great, honestly. It's just kind of spooky, but it doesn't really lead into anything like you would think it would, but it doesn't, so it's lame. It's lame. Okay, I want to go this way. Yeah. Okay. See if we can see if we can find the shrine. So, that's definitely something, so, uh, I lost my train of thought, but I was thinking about how, oh, there's that brush room, I think, maybe, maybe not, I was thinking about something, and I've forgotten, so, yeah. Cool. Thought I could share that with you. There's, there's gotta be a shrine around here, right? I think, yeah. I was thinking about how... I was trying, I was thinking, I was comparing this in my head to... I was thinking about, okay, so I was thinking about... Link to the Past, not Link to the Past, uh, Wind Waker and this game, and thinking about, because they both, like, have expo elements of exploration in them. This game is more, like, focused on giving you the, like, unlimited options, and, alright, we're just out of here. We're gonna go to the Fairy Fountain. This game is more about giving you more options, and Wind Waker was more about, like, it had, like, it had, a, like, a feeling to it. I don't know if that's true or not, but like I think it's just the combination of the theming and the music. Just every place felt like there was like a thing about it. This game doesn't really have that feel to it, but it it. I mean, it, the Rudo place does, but that's only because it's like remember Wind Waker. That's what it just feels like. It feels like remember this. Remember this thing that you enjoyed more. But I, I'm not saying I enjoyed. Well, I, I was that basically sound like I was saying Wind Waker. Wind Waker. I don't know, maybe it's just because it's, it's something I grew up with, so it's something, it just has that feel to it, something familiar. I don't know. I feel like it would be cool if this game had more stuff that was like, I don't know. Then again, this game, I feel like it's, it's, it's a lot like Wind Waker, in that it's just like, there's like lots to explore, but there's, Wind Waker was just, there's a lot of nothing. This game has a lot of, just a lot. So, I don't know, this is kind of like a better Wind Waker, really. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't have the, the items and stuff, but I don't really care about that. Like, all the items in the dungeons and stuff, I, I couldn't care less about that. Uh, okay, well. Oh yeah, we were going to talk to the fairy lady. I was hoping there'd be some fairies around, but there's not. Alright, Kesa. Uh. Let's see. So, red chew jelly. I think we could make some of that. Right now, actually. Let's do that. Okay. So, if we make a fire, we've got the stuff for it. Right, let's put it here. We only need one of these and one of these. Drop them, and we use something like this. And then, let's see, we need three of each, so. Okay, let's just. Okay, yep. 
Just in case you didn't know, you could do this. So, I mean, I figured out. It's kind of straightforward. It's not really like something you would. It's not. It's something you could figure out. I feel like because it's like, well, you know, it can catch on fire, and yeah. I believe this game has something called a chemistry engine, which isn't really an engine. It's more like just like a bunch of things that can happen. I feel like, but so something I learned from a video is that you can actually throw you can throw an, a rusty sword at one of the bomb octoroks and it will blast out a regular sword which is pretty cool mm. yes please uh. maybe we can get some more chew jellies and upgrade even more upgrade uh. the stuff even higher Enhance away. Can this be enhanced again? Yeah, so I need Saflina. Saflina? I think that, mm. I think you can find that in the desert. So, mm. we have to get our hands on that. So let's, let's see if I think we'll make a few more chew jellies. I think we only need six. So make a few more fire chew jellies. And we'll move on to something else. What will we do? I'm trying to remember if there's anything else we need to do. But I think we, maybe we'll just head over to the desert and get that... Uh, Get some Saflinas or whatever. We can't just teleport over there. We're gonna have to. Gonna have to ride our horse. I think. Yeah. So if we go. So this whole area right here is like an ice area. So. If we go from here, we can ride down and go to the desert. Go to the desert. Let's see, so I'm trying to see if there's anywhere else that we could go that might be a better idea. There is a shrine here. Let's try to go to that shrine. Let's see what happens. If it gets too sketchy, we'll just teleport somewhere else. Yeah, we'll get that shrine if we can, and then get another shrine that'll be four we'll get that shrine if we can then we'll we'll uh, get to another heart let's see uh where's the shrine which direction that way that way is that the shrine over there yeah that's the shrine okay let's try not to die here This is pretty dang sketchy. Oh, yeah, cool. Cool. I should have slept through the, through the night. I really should have. Should have done that. Okay, they don't care anymore. As long as there's no guardians, we'll be fine. Oh, let's see if we can get this. Come on. Ugh. Endurish room, just what we need to chase this guy. Come on. There we go. Oh, this is sketchy. Whoa, okay, hello. Hello, hello. Uh, where's the marking? Does it not show up? On here? Should. 
Hello. Um, yeah, yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's not do this. Mm. We'll go, we'll go here now because we have the, uh, we have the cold resist stuff. So let's go there. It's kind of what, what, why we went to get it, is to... To make it so we can go to cold places so and a lot of hyrule is cold lots of large a large portion of hyrule is pretty dang cold so <laughs> we will go there and then i think we'll get the next fairy fountain or at least we'll find it you know? we may not we may not unlock it but we'll find it that's for sure So this way, this way, this way, this way. If I just look, if I just were to look around, it would be pretty clear which direction I need to go. But yeah. whatever. What is that? It's a stupid mushroom. It's okay. It's a radish, which makes it worth it. Well, I'm going to start working on my next game pretty soon. Pretty excited about that. Um, I just need to... Okay, whatever. I just need to finish reading. So I'm reading the Unity documentation. The Unity... Unity is what I've used to make my games. I used to, what I used to develop games. And... Um, uh, I've been... I'm reading the documentation so I can just... Because the... Uh, so the way I built the last game probably wasn't the most efficient way, and there was probably better ways I could have done things. So I'm just trying to read through the documentation just to make sure I understand how everything works, and I'm definitely learning a lot from just from doing that because I'm I'm already familiar with how it works, Unity works, but I want to get more familiar with how how everything works, how. I, um, I want to just know how to use it, all of it, so that is why I'm doing that. Uh, that's why I'm reading it. And I'm almost through it. Well, I'd say I'm probably like halfway through. Okay. Hmm. I've got a genuine problem here. I think we can eat this. Focus on this guy. Get that bow. That's a good bow. Okay. Okay, we don't need a strong weapon. A little full sound, huh? It's a pretty good actually. Compared to what I have. But we'll take we'll take one. Can't really carry anymore. But anyways, as I was saying, was this the last one? Nope. As I was saying, the the Unity documentation. Uh, I've been learning a lot. That you, you know, just reading, in general, reading like how to do something as opposed to just figuring it out or just watching tutorials. Reading the actual documentation on this thing is probably a good idea, just because just so you know how everything works, and or at least know where to find the stuff you need to use to know how everything works. Nope, I wanted to kill. I wanted to kill a, a, a ice quail or whatever that is. Snow quail. Let's see. That was a snow. That was a ice dragon. Ice dragonfly. Whatever.
Here we go. Oh, I, how much you want to bet it's a trial of strength? I think I'd probably be fine if it was a minor test of strength. Oh no, look at that. It's a gibby. It's a gimme. Right, let's see what we got. Oh, look at that. It's a climbing boot. Just what I wanted. Just what I was just talking about would be cool to have. I just need to find the shirt and then we'll be we'll be uh we'll be done with that. We'll have the whole thing. Oh what a good day. We've got the leggings and now we can get another heart. And then we can get the uh, master sword. I think you need thirteen hearts. I've got seven So, making progress, slowly but surely making progress, slower than I'd like, faster than, uh, I like, faster than, um, I don't know, faster than something, I'm sure. Right, we need to get upgraded, so, uh, we're I'm getting a little bit of lag. How long have we been going for? Uh, Seventeen minutes. Not too long. Yeah, we're fine. I don't know what the big deal is. Got plenty of space on the hard drive. A good old hard drive. Seventeen minutes. See if we can get some of those purple mushrooms. I don't know where we would get them exactly, but let's grab this egg. Oh, okay. It's interesting that you can climb on pretty much any any surface. I like it. Uh, I won't fail. Okay, let's go. Let's go through this door. Okay. Getting all the memories was definitely not one of the things that I had on the list of things that needed to be done. But I think I might end up getting all the memories. So just to clarify, the reason I'm only going for heart containers is uh, is just to uh, focus on getting the Master Sword. Which, uh, I'm not sure if I really need to do that, but, because Wait, new clothes, really? Oh, those aren't new. Alright, well. Uh, so, I was saying that. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I don't really need to, to get only hearts to get the Master Sword. I mean, there's no. The only reason I need the Master Sword is to do the Master Trials, really, and to beat Ganon, obviously, but. And it helps to fight the uh, the divine beast things with that as well. So yeah. let's go here, and then we'll go Loshlo Harbor, huh? This is not what I thought it meant by Loshlo Harbor. I thought it meant the village that's down here. But that is actually down here ish. So, mm, which, does it lead there? I'm pretty sure it does not, actually. 
So maybe... Hmm. So I know there's treasure here. There's definitely there's treasure here. So let's go there, actually. I think that will be fun to get real quick. There's also a, uh, a giant. Oh, an undead Henix. I forgot about those. I mean, is it, they've got those, the undead Henix things. Those are cool. There's an undead Henix that spawns there. I remember finding it. I remember finding it. It was cool. So that's the third thing. The third giant boss. So I get it. It's cool. Cool. That is a separate giant boss thing, which I I do. I would say it counts as an extra boss. These guys have ice have like stupid arrows. Just go ahead and kill this guy. That's right. There we go. Oh, is he over there? Come on. Come to me. Come to me and you will die. I didn't realize this was two-handed. Oh, that's kind of lame. I thought, yeah, the broadsword is what I was going for. Yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> I feel a little OP at the moment. Uh, obviously not against this stuff, but... Let's see. Is there anything here that I, I don't really care for this, so... I do need those to upgrade something. What can we drop? Let's drop this. Alright. Got a pretty good spear from that. Feeling pretty good right now. About where we are. So yeah, it does look like you can get some better weapons in this uh, than before from from those things. So gonna... so. Uh, I already have a Boko, whatever. Let's just switch to it, just since we're going to be getting a lot more of those. Shield. Ah, uh, I need upgrades. Upgrades, I need upgrades. Oh, I need to be able to hold more shields. shooting at me. I guess that's one way to get stuff. Did he just go onto the bridge like that? 
Okay, come on, bring it on, buddy. Guys are the these guys are such so they were they're the worst. They are the worst. Just stop. Go away. Feeling pretty strong. Let's go ahead and switch to. So, we're gonna grab those things up there so we can upgrade this armor just to make it stronger. Okay, there's three. Too. This is very entertaining to watch. This is the stuff that you like to see. This is what you have signed up for. One more. We just need one more rush. Sure. Just need one more rush room. There it is. There's a rush room. Just got to grab the rush room. It's right there. Now we will glide. Glide to our death. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 